Hey everybody, David here, and I wanted to talk about the, some Power Ranger news that, you know, some pictures were posted on Ranger Board uh, lately that I wanted to talk about. So apparently someone on Ranger Board has found uh, the, a school that has an Angel Grove uh, banner and logo on the school. And the school, from what I've seen on the pictures, looks like the same school that was used for Smallville. Knowing that this Power Ranger movie is actually being filmed in Vancouver, where Smallville used to film, uh, I, I think it is the same school. It could be the same school. So this is actually really cool news. A lot of fans are noticing that the logo they used for Angel Grove, their uh, the crest, is exactly the same crest, or it looks almost exactly the same as the, the TV show crest. For Angel Grove, you know, every school has their own little symbol crest thing, and Angel Grove has theirs. And this is actually really cool because now it has a lot of fans speculating: Oh, are we going to see Miss Appleby? Are we going, you know, who's the teacher on the show? Are we going to see uh, Mr. Mr. Kaplan? Um, I think this would be cool, like nice little Easter eggs for the fans who know those characters, like. I don't think they'll play big roles. If anything, it will probably be a nice little cameo role for a smaller actor, supporting actor, whoever's playing that role in the movie. I don't think they'll they'll bother getting a big actor. I hope not. Like I, I don't want the comedy in this movie to be like slapstick. I think that works fine for the show because it's for kids. But I think if you're going to do a theatrical picture, I don't think slapstick works as well as it used to. Uh, which kind of brings me to the top of, of Bulk and Skull, who are the two bullies back in the old series. And um, I hope if they do introduce those two, I hope they are not over-the-top slapstick bullies, you know? I hope they ground them a little bit more and make them... Like, if they want to make jokes out of them, sure, go for it. Like, make Zack say something witty to Bulk and Skull to make fun of them, like, and people in the audience could be, ooh, you know? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just... As long as it's not slapstick, because I think... I think I realize that a lot of people don't like that type of humor when uh, presented to a larger audience. If you want to get the general audience in the seats, don't slapstick comedy. Believe me, it's a bad idea. Uh, but with that being said, guys, I think this is pretty cool. Angel Grove High. I mean, we got an Angel Grove police car not too long ago. Uh, we've heard the sort of, some sources say in Vancouver that they are they found like some places near a quarry that filming of a movie is going to be taking place there. So they are definitely doing a lot of callbacks to the show, which really excites me because it, it means they, unlike a lot of other movies, which, you know, fans get pissed off when, when something doesn't stay true to a comic book or a book, this seems to be kind of sticking true to somewhat to the, to the TV show in a more grounded fashion. From my understanding, that's their plan. So this is looking good. I'm still eager to see what the real costumes are going to look like. We had that cast photo not too long ago. So, yeah, I mean, this, again, is once again saying things are looking good for this movie, and I can't wait to check it out coming, I believe, March 2017. So uh, stay tuned. I'll try to talk about every update that I hear about this movie, any reports that I hear. I want to be the, the guy that, like, talks about everything of this Power Ranger movie because I think it needs some more exposure. And... I think someone like a fan, like myself, someone who's been a long, dedicated fan, uh, should be the one reporting it. And there's a lot of other fans, I'm sure, that are talking about this as well. So fans should sh fans should be the one to talk about this show because I think we're the ones that understand it the most. Uh, people like you know, I watch Collider Movie Talk. I can tell those guys don't don't get the show, and they've admitted it. They admit that they haven't grown up with it, so they don't understand it. They don't understand how it works or whatever. Um, they don't appreciate the mythology like true fans do. And I'm not just talking about the fans that just like Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I'm talking the, about the, the fans that have gone beyond Mighty Morphin, like myself, the ones that have watched Zeo, Turbo, Space, Lost Galaxy, etc., etc. These are the fans that understand the series the most and appreciate the mythology that the show has grown 
uh, over the years. So um, I'm excited to see this movie, and uh, I hope you guys are too. And tell me if you are. Tell me your thoughts. What do you think of Angel Grove High School being in the movie? Is it really giving you flashbacks of the past? I don't know. I'm very excited. And until next time, guys, take care.